Hundreds of pets have been left homeless after the devastating earthquakes in Puerto Rico. But now, after an incredibly long journey, many have a chance at a new life here on the U.S. mainland. CBS's Lisa Mateo brings us the story. For these precious pets, St. Hubert's Animal Welfare Center in New Jersey is more than a temporary home. About 40 rescue dogs arrived into the shelter over the weekend after traveling more than 1,000 miles from the earthquake-ravaged island of Puerto Rico. We have some younger puppy-like dogs, and then there are probably some in the three to four, so there are some adult ones as well. Michelle Thevenin of St. Hubert says the canines were removed from shelters overwhelmed with new rescues on the island. We typically think, oh, they're going to euthanize all the animals, but no, they sent them to us so we can adopt them out. Animal rescue teams airlifted about 100 pets from San Juan to shelters right here in New Jersey and other states in a race to get them adopted. There are over half a million stray dogs uh, across Puerto Rico. Eric Larnick of the Sato Project orchestrated the effort in conjunction with Wings of Rescue, which flew the at-risk pets to safety. They've already gone through a vetting process. You know, they've already been treated clinically, so, you know, their chances for adoption are pretty great. The organizations also delivered much-needed supplies to the people of Puerto Rico still living in the disaster zone. As the island continues to recover, they hope the animals find new families to love them in the states. Lisa Mateo, CBS News, New Jersey. A series of earthquakes and aftershocks have hit Puerto Rico since December, causing widespread damage and power outages. We'll be